you're doing for me three pounds. The smile that won, Katie. A brown. Give me that smile again. <laughs> Hey everybody, it's the Papa from the Papa's Kitchen. I'm up in Lincoln, Nebraska, and I have my oldest grandson with me, um, who is a married man now, but we'll talk about that in another video. Tomorrow, uh, for our church, we start three days, like we do every quarter, of fasting and prayer. So people uh, fast whatever the Lord is showing them to fast, and there's prayer time every uh, night. So Monday night, Tuesday night, Wednesday night, all the church gets together and at seven, I think, or six or whatever, and they've come for an hour of prayer and worship and all that. And then here's the deal, why we're together right now is that on the last night in the fall, historically, and I started it at the church when I was pastoring, they have a chili cook-off and the Stinky Boot Award is presented and given for the next year. Yep. It's not a crown, it's a stinky boot. Mm -hmm. It's given for the next year to the chili that the judges anonymously have yep. determined by taste, by appearance, and by popularity, I suppose, maybe, have determined to be the best. Yep. So, you're yep. here to help me cook a chili submission. Yeah. Right? We're we're trying to cook the winner here. We're gonna cook the winner. That's because exactly right. I've only That's I've, right. I I've gotten second place one time. <laughs> oh did you? This is my year to get number one. Did you? You got second? Yeah. What did you do? Do you know? I don't remember actually. Oh. Well this is on behalf of all the Wania clan. Ago. Yeah. Because it is a big batch, right? It is a big batch. And the way we do this, uh, Judah, it's really pretty easy. I'm going to put in here uh, three pounds of ground beef. After that is browned, we're going to drain that pot. Now right. that's the only draining we do. We've got to get that brown pretty quick. In the meantime, what I'm going to do is get some of the other ingredients ready. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take the can opener. What? <laughs> and I'm going to open the can. What do you want from me, Susan? No, you do, <laughs> we would have to use the can opener no matter what well, to get true. to the ingredients that's in the can. So what I've got, I've got two 28 ounce cans of diced tomatoes and I've got two 28 ounce cans of tomato sauce. Now this is all gonna combine and do, be really, really, really good. But we've got to get that browned. How is it going, Judah? We're making progress. All righty. Better get over here and check out the brown beef. <laughs> Whoa, I just broke up the brown bits, so it doesn't look very brown yet. Oh, okay. And if this is a winning deal, Judah, mm -hmm. I would, I'm not here on Wednesday, but I would prefer a little credit. I'll make sure to give you a, a little mention. A mention in my, in my reception speech. In your, yes, in your acceptance yeah. speech. Yeah. Yes, that I, I owe everything I am cooking wise to my papa, the pop from the papa's kitchen, and then give him the link, would you please? Add the link to the Papa's Kitchen. Yeah, for the YouTube link. We'll just be added in two days for us to post the link up. This will be, we won't put this up until a week after the chili cook-off. Oh, That's see. true, but it will be edited by the professional editor. Who's yeah. your professional editor? Yeah. Me. Oh. You're looking at it. Me. Katie's helping. She's telling. I'm just here for support. She's here for support, but. Yeah. She is. She is actually the cook. She has I'm just never, telling them what to do. Yeah, Judah, keep making. This will be your first year attending. <laughs> this will be your first year attending the chili cook-off, though, won't it? No, I was here last year. Were you? I okay. just don't remember the competition part. Ah, okay. Okay. Well, there is competition, and it runs hot and deep in this. It's dramatic. We got this all drained off. Put in this whole six-ounce right. can of tomato paste, please. Just one? That's interesting. Yeah, just one for that. Mm -hmm. 
all right and then this is one pound of breakfast pork sausage Ooh. and if you would break that up and we're not going to drain that we're going to let that just cook and get brown yum Probably yeah. In there. Yeah. Wait, that's. Sounds good. Yeah. A little different. Yeah, it's different. I like where this is going so yeah. far. And why don't I do this, Judah, if you don't mind? I'm going to uh, do that stirring for you. Okay. And would you take this onion and the, chop the whole onion? Mm -hmm. In addition, take the jalapenos. Do you know what to do with the jalapeno with. Um, yeah, you want to take the inside. I want the seeds out. Seeds yeah. Out, yeah. So I just usually split it down, you know, and open it up, and um, and then lay it out, and I just get the seeds out. That way. Put them, yeah, put them down. Watch that you don't touch your eyes, you know. Yeah, exactly. But I sort of do this. Now you could leave the seeds in. No. But Susan said no, and. <laughs> See, we're not going to do it. Okay. It'll be interesting to see how hot this is. Here, can I get a bigger knife? Hopefully the judge eyes? likes yeah, spicy. Um, I don't. Uh. Judah, in your opinion, do you feel like three jalapenos is way too much? Oh, no. <gasps> Definitely not. Not with this much Do meat. you think the judges like... We have like three pounds of meat. One jalapeno per pound. We got four pounds of meat. Do they have to oh, yeah. four pounds. Yeah. Three pounds and a pound of pork sausage. Yeah. I don't think you'd be able to taste any less than three jalapenos, really. Well, okay. Hopefully the judges like a little spice. enjoy a little bit of character. Do you want to open those for Sure. Sure, if you want to get your hands spicy. Yeah, I will get my hands don't spicy. Don't pick your eyes. I will. Who does the cooking at your house, mainly? Uh, Depends. So hasn't pretty much been, him. Hasn't been very long yet, but yeah, yeah it's only been. Yeah, mostly but, you. You have you cook curry. You cook the Mexican like yeah. like chipotle bowl things. And then you have leftovers, so then you heat them up the next day. Yeah. And, yeah. yeah. The only yeah. thing I've cooked is like eggs and. She cooks the simple stuff. Cooks. Eggs. Good. And you know how to do a chop, right? Yeah, I can chop it. Slice the chop, right? Yeah. Chili's gonna be good. What I like is a meaty chili. That's what I like, and this is what this is gonna be. I hate when the chili, you get it and you look it around, or even like pork sausage on your biscuits in the morning. I hate just a lot of gravy and no, um, no, meat. no meat. Where's the meat kind of thing, you know? And you're going, oh my goodness sake. And I like a beanless chili. Yes. Me too. This, this is going to have a is... little bit. No, it's going to have a little bit in there. But not much. Not right? much. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay, we've got everything browned. Add three ounces of William's original chili seasoning mix in there. All right, this is three ounces. Three right? ounces and stir that in really good, yeah. Three ounces is one package or two? It, it, it's a two ounce package and a one ounce package. Oh, okay. That's why I put it in there, not just to avoid oh, that Oh, so it question. comes in seas in Yeah, it comes in even in sizes. jars, but I couldn't find jars. Just oh, turn that around. Oh. And then what I want to do, Katie, is add the onions, uh, jalapenos chopped down. Put this in. There you go. And Katie, while he's stirring that in, yes. this big knife, just stick these up here and just put a good, uh, chop on them. Just slice like that? Yeah, That's it. you know, you want small pieces though. Um, and what I do is I always take the big knife and I do it like this and then I sort of come back you around. Dice them. dice them. really pretty good, yeah. Okay. So that they're not big for people, you know what I mean? Yes. And, uh, oh, there's another one. And do that. And okay. Judah, while she's doing that, that what I did, I cheated <laughs> I really am not the best at this. We need, <laughs> it six, doesn't matter. we need six cloves of garlic, and I happen to have here in the fridge a minced garlic already yeah. uh, chopped, which makes my life easier right now than peeling garlic. And we're going to do six of these in here. And what right. we want to do is we want to keep cooking this. That's two, right? Yeah. Three. Three. Yeah, you're good. Four. 
can do one more. That's enough right there. You're yeah, overdoing it. Because you're, we, yeah. uh, the first one wasn't really No, it really anyway, wasn't. So. No, so you're good. And what we want to do, folks, is we want, when she gets the peppers put in here, we want to just stir this so that it's soft. And just drop them in here. There you go. There you go. And keep stirring those just for a few moments until all of these onions and the and if you're using real garlic, but we have sort of minced it, um, until these onions and uh, these peppers get a little soft. That's really all you want. Just like that. Boy, that's going to be yeah. some flavor, that's isn't a, it, though? That's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah, yeah, it really is. Just sort of like that. And then all we're going to do, Judah, after that's done, I'm going to add two can, 44 ounces, basically, of the diced tomatoes. So you can go ahead and put those in. And we're going to add... You don't drain them, right? No, no. no we we need want all that on. beautiful exactly. juice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then we want to put in the two cans or the 44 ounces of tomato sauce. Yeah, you can get those over there if he's stirring. You want them both in now? I think so, yeah. And then, Judah, just to make things extremely interesting for us, flavor-wise, mm -hmm. we're going to add also one can, almost lost it here, oh, there we go, green chili. of green chilies in there. Wow. There you and go. And that is going to be good. Use that to <laughs> scoop them all out, would you please? I hope that the judges like spice. <laughs> yes. Do you know who judges it? Anyone I don't know. I, they I don't change know. it every year, I know. Really? Mm -hmm. I don't. I would, they change them every year. Yeah. 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 We'll see. Who, we don't even. I think they do it anonymously, actually. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. See, that that's good. good chili right look at there. All the green in there and yeah. the colors. Now look at what we want to do is for the next hour, with the lid on, we're going to let this simmer low on this stove and not even touch it. And by the way, an hour minimum, folks. One hour minimum. Let this simmer. Let me just feel it a little bit. I want to get a little impression here. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm telling you, that's going to be good chili. <laughs> just a little bit. And we haven't even added the beans yet because that'll oh. come after the hour, okay? okay? So this, and that's a lot of chili. That's going to be good. Did you put salt? No, no. Everything. Uh, oh, I told that you, seasoning has that salt. That seasoning all has it. Yeah. So there it is. For one hour on okay. the stove at a nice little simmer. We leave it alone. There you go. We All leave right. it alone for one yeah. hour minimum. All right, and then we'll come back and show you the rest in a few minutes. Uh, the uh, chili has been cooking now, simmering, actually boiling a little bit, we didn't realize, for the last hour and a half, almost two hours, so that's good. Nothing's wrong with that. That just fuses the flavor. Bush's beans makes these chili magic, and there are beans in there and all that. We're going to add three cans of this, and these cans are... Um, uh, can you read that? I don't have my glasses on. How many ounces? Oh, 13.5 ounces. Okay, we're going to add those in and then we're going to let it cook for another about 30 minutes before we turn it off totally. So you just put them straight Add them in. in straight in. Yeah, buddy. I bet there's more spice in there. I imagine there is. It's Jeez. chili starter in little, here. I oh, tasted it and it had a little spice, but not bad. Not bad. No, no, no. We're but, making it for the general public. Well, yeah. I'm going to love it. You're going to love it. Hopefully the executives are going to love it. They will. Okay, stir that up. Let's see what we get. Great. Alrighty. And honestly, even without those beans being cooked, let's just try and see what we get here. If it's good enough for the public consumption. Alright. Go ahead, Katie. Mm. You judge too. too. Mm. 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 You have to mm. blow it. Is it good? Yes. Is this his reaction every time he cooks something? Yes. <laughs> that is so flavorful. You know him. You know him. Blow on it a lot. It's hot. Oh, especially that big. Oh, it's going to burn. But it is so good. I'm going to wait a little bit. Mm. Is that good? 
If you were a judge, you would absolutely give that first prize with a hundred dollar check. Yeah, <laughs> with a stinky boot. It's the winner. It's the winner. It's the winner. I gotta believe it is. So mm. what we'll do is we're gonna follow up after the the spicy. The, it is. It's got, a, <laughs> it's got a little spice. I like it. Good? Like I like the it's spice. It's so good. I it love is. it. It's it got is. a depth of flavor so, too. Look at what we'll do. I won't be around, mm -hmm. but she'll get you two on camera on Wednesday night. Okay. And you, yeah. when they announce the winner, they'll have Actually, like like the Emmys. Mm -hmm. Like the, like the, um, is it the Emmys? No, it's the Oscar. Their faces. This is, who knows. And it'll be either, uh, or it'll be, we won. We actually have a little issue. What I'm supposed have? to announce the winner. Are you really? Oh, you are? I'm going to find me. someone else to do it. <laughs> I'm the well, winner. Yes. Then I made the killing. There you go. There you go. <laughs> stand in for the papa. Yeah, there stand in go. for the yep. papa. Katie, I anoint you to stand in okay. for the papa. You're dead. Well, You're done. Dress like you and everything. No, don't no. do that. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Well, I think it might win. I really do. So we'll see. I think it's a good choice. All right. So there you had it, folks. You had the recipe. We went through it. And uh, it, by the way, it's fall every, most everywhere in the country. So this is the great time to make chili. Look at, I mean, this is just beautiful and meaty. Uh, that's what I like about a good chili. And boy, I'll tell you what, in a bowl with some uh, shredded uh, cheddar so cheese on it, a little blob sour of cream. sour cream, sour cream. Mm, the yeah. sour cream. some cut up sour little scallions, the yes. green part on top sprinkled. Mm -hmm. Oh my, and then on the side, what they do here, I never knew this, but up here, this is what they, a cinnamon roll. Yep. All right, guys, that's it. That's the Papa's Chili recipe, um, Papa's and chili. we'll let you know who wins. See you later. See you later. You are worthy of it all. tell everybody how much chili because one of mine are in here Which one it's the papa's kitchen has one in here Does i'm not telling you it's a meat one with very little beans but look at these somebody put extra jalapenos <laughs> hi peace <laughs> okay can you guess which one is Papa's? Uh oh, do you think it's gonna win? No, I don't know. I don't the judges know. are in there deliberating There's right so now. There's so many to choose from. There are. You have to find a way to really stand out. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll see. We'll see. We've narrowed it down to the final three. <laughs> Evan, you want to go ahead and announce the third place? Oh, yeah. Fine. Mm. Everybody say, ooh. ooh. Ah. Ah. All right. In third place. Okay. Third place. Third place. Everybody say, third place. Third place. Okay, we got a drum roll. Dawn! Dawn! Where's Dawn? Atta boy. You get a door! Derek! You get a million dollars! Find a contract! Alright. Good job. Second place. Is none other than Judah Moanya and Terry. Watch cut the onions. <laughs> <laughs> the yeah. kitchen. If you want to know how to make it, it's going up on YouTube next week. <laughs> All that aside, second place. But now, all right, now we've got number one in the Stinky Boot Award in my hand. Sand boot. Right here, the much coveted boot. It smells a little better than last year. <laughs> all right, let's get a real drum roll going. Let's 
hosts and none other than Maddie Sp- You didn't win, but yep. you got second place. We got place. second. If you guys remember, I said while we were cooking, I've gotten second place before, at least once, maybe two times. I'm gonna have to. This is, I feel like it's a post-game interview. Yeah. We're gonna have to get together with the coaches. That's right. You're gonna have to do better. With the team, we're gonna have yeah. to rewrite the strategy and Spice stand out better. Chili. Next oh, year, no. we'll maybe, go for number maybe one. Maybe it was too spicy. What do you think? The other two winners had a lot of beans in them. Oh. I think Maybe like beans. Maybe like beans. Oh, maybe. They like beans. Like, yeah. Okay. I mean, the competition oh, well. is very high. Second is better than third. We competed at the highest level. And, and a girl yeah. beat you. A youth student. A youth girl. 